It was nice to have a quiet evening. Honestly, it was nice to be able to have dinner this evening. I love that. Last night I talked all night. Outside as we look at our weather today, we had a lot of sunshine. Sunny to partly cloudy from time to time. There were a few spotty showers that popped up for some, but not in this particular view. And not many over the triad, but areas to the south and east were a little different. I'll show you that. 53 right now, 68 our high. We're still windy out there. Winds out of the west northwest, 26 miles per hour sustained. 53 was the low this morning, but the windiest place of all was last evening in Wilkes County. We did have a confirmed tornado, and that was one of the reasons we were on the air with cut ins. We were talking about Wilkes County for a long time. 645 to 648, there was a tornado on the ground, and it was on the ground for two miles with a width of 300 yards. So its power was 105 to 110, which makes it an EF1 had it been just one mile per hour higher an EF two would have been the case. 111 is where that starts. Now as we take a look out there tonight, it's a cool night. It's going to get cooler. We're in the low to mid 50s right now across the Triad region and back into the foothills. We've got low 50s. No reports for Wilkes County the last several days. Hopefully they will get their reporting site working again. We've got low 40s in the mountains with 33 degrees up at Beach Mountain. Wind gust currently in the Triad 33, but our wind gust today hit 43. Up in the mountains, they hit 59. North Wilkesboro did report their wind 36 miles per hour. Satellite radar shows you it's a quiet night out there for us. There are some showers up in northern Grayson and Carroll counties, and it might drop a sprinkle in the northern part of the area, but they're likely going to be falling apart. And down to the south and east, we had some weather earlier. That's already moved off the coast, and you can see as we go through the night tonight, those showers again falling apart, and generally, mainly clear skies for us here in the Piedmont tonight. Weekend looks good too with high pressure in charge. We'll have some cool mornings tonight and again Sunday morning, but the days will be warming up pretty dramatically. 70 tomorrow and then we're going up to around 80 degrees on Sunday afternoon. Lots of 80s over the deep south, even some 90s and that warmer air is coming our way for next week. We will have many days that will feel really good. Tonight the winds will settle down a little bit as we go deeper into the night. And as we go into the day tomorrow, they will pick up again. Not quite as high as they did here today. It would be a little stronger in the eastern part of our state. Our beach forecast is gorgeous. If you have a chance to go to the coast this weekend, do it. 71 and 72 with sunshine. If you think you're ready to put your toes in the water, Water's getting better. In the winter, it was down in the upper 40s to around 50. Now it's back in the mid 60s. Typically in the summer, we're around 81 to 85 most days. So it's still a shock to the system if you're thinking about what summer's like. 58 in the mountains with sunshine tomorrow, 70 degrees on Sunday. In the Piedmont overnight, down to 45, partly cloudy to mostly clear. Tomorrow, a beautiful day and a high near 70. Here's your extended forecast. Good looking weather for quite a while from 70 tomorrow to 80 on Sunday. Mid 80s Monday and Tuesday, low to mid 80s after that. A few more clouds and then a shower chance on Friday. 8 to 12 days out. You can see those temperatures come down. We're talking low to mid 60s. That whole panel is nothing but 60, so enjoy next week because we still get some bouts of cool weather even in late parts of April. Three degree guarantee tonight's low 45. My guarantee for today was for a low of 53, and we had 53.